Hey, Scott Sager here with you. You know, when you see me standing next to this guy, it can only mean one thing, and it's the uh, annual 5K run at the Chili Cook-Off for the United Way. Jeff Hunter here with me. Jeff, how was your race today? Hey, I'll tell you, it, it was the weather was great. Yeah. It's, the sun's are shining. Yeah. I will have to admit, a couple of days ago, though, I was running without a shirt on, and today it was, do I wear sweats? Right. Why do I wear? Right. Yeah. So, uh, so, second time I've been out, and each year it seems like it keeps growing. It yeah. keeps getting a bigger and bigger. Um, I see a lot more of us older guys coming out and yeah. participating, and it was great to see all the kids again this year. Yeah. Uh, it's a fantastic event for our local community. Absolutely. Well, uh, yeah. it is a great thing. It raises a lot of money for the United Way of Fulton County. County. We are seeing some older people. We're seeing a lot of the young kids too. We like Absolutely. that. Um, I have to work, unfortunately, so I can't run in that's it. That's true. But, that's true. But you know, maybe some year uh, Abby can take over and and I could run it. I will have to say it though, this is the first time I've ever been to a 5K race where we actually had a bison yeah. at it. We had but, a bison uh, here. You know, we, we've got uh, it all here in Rochester. Loyal made it. You got. You can see the courthouse that's from right. here. It's just that's an epic right. view. So uh, thank right. you for being out. And hey, thanks for all that you do. What you do for us. Thanks, Barbara. thanks. Hey, Scott Sager here. We've got Darren Beaker. Everybody knows Darren's a big uh, health nut, right? I suppose. Health nut. Can sure. we call you a nut? Sure, why not? All right. You know he's, he's all about health, and uh, you really have seen the reasons why you need to be worried about your health most of your life, right? Sure do. Yeah. So, uh, Darren Beaker out here at the 5K run. How was your run today? Pretty good. It was a nice day. Temperatures were nice. Yeah. Sun was beaming down a little bit, but yeah, otherwise. It's sunny as can be, not a cloud in the sky, and the temperature uh, 48 this morning is a low, about 60 by the time you guys started running. Felt good today. Yeah, not too bad. Felt good. You like your time? I don't know what it is yet. Oh, okay. Still, Very still waiting good. to find out. Well, it was good. Just yeah, we'll say it's good it right great. now. It was a great time. Um, talk to me a little bit about the course itself. You enjoy this little course they got here? <clears throat> yeah, it's a nice flat course out and back. Yeah. A lot of trees. Yeah. Uh, a little bit of shade every once in a while. A little shade today, and, and uh, traffic wasn't too bad out there. Good, good, good. Well, uh, Scott Sager out here at the Chili Cook-Off. Darren Beaker with me. Great job today. Thanks, Thanks. for being here. Thanks, Scott. All right, buddy. Okay, we've got another runner here, one of our younger runners. What's your name? Dolan. Dolan, with a D, right? Very good. You enjoy your race today? Yeah. Yeah, do you race a lot? No, not. I, sometimes I do. Sometimes, and yeah. you, you enjoyed this one today, though? You got your free uh, Red Hot uh, T-shirt on, right? Okay, how was the course today? Um, good. You enjoyed it? Yeah. Excellent. Well, we've got Dolan here, one of the runners from the uh, 5K run here at the Chili Cook-Off. Well, we've got one of Rochester Telephone Company's own, Mr. Tim Yarber, survived the 5K. Barely. Tim, uh, how many of these do you do? Uh, this is my first one. First one ever? Yes. Oh my gosh, you look pretty good. You were still standing. You were running with stride when you came well, you through. You guys almost had better coverage of me over there, but I held in. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been bad. Yeah, it would have. But uh, so hey, you know, time. yeah, time for the water. Well, 5Ks, just getting into them, came out here for the Chili Cook-Off 5K. What would you think of the course? Perfect. Yeah. A little bit of hills, yeah. turns. Yeah, yeah. It's challenging when people are starting to come the other way. Yeah. So that well, was cool. We've had over a hundred people today. Uh, the record crowd for their uh, or participants for the uh, chili cook-off race here makes a lot of money for the uh, United Way here in Fulton Good. County. Yeah. Um, so you're going to be doing this a lot. Are we going to see you out running everywhere? I'm going to continue running through the winter and just try to keep it around two mile, maybe three. K Excellent. Pace, not Excellent. 5K. I'll be back next year. Well, sure. proud of you for that, my friend. You keep that up, and uh, you keep all the good work you're doing at RTC, okay? Thank you. Tim Yarber for you. Thanks.
Yeah, Tom. Hey, wait, Tom, he's coming up on you. I just heard it work there. I got clipped on the end of this. Hey, Scott Sager here with you. We're, of course, at the Chili Cook-Off. Last year, we were at this booth to start out. We're here again. It's Putman Bail Bonds, right? That's the name of the booth. Who am I with? Henry. Henry. First year for Chili. Henry, you've been doing this a while? Nope, first year. First year, okay. What's special about the uh, Putman Bail Bonds Chili this year? Ashley, help me out. <laughs> Ashley. She won't turn around and talk to us. A secret spice. We like secret spices here. So a uh, pretty good turnout so far today as far as the uh, number of crews competing. we got a lot of motorcycles right here in front of Putts as part of the show. You having a good time? Yeah. Excellent. Yeah, you yeah. coming back next year? Oh, most definitely. Hey, we're here with Henry Putnam Bail Bonds. Glad they're a sponsor this year. Thanks for being here. Thanks. Hey, right. we're here with our next booth. Which booth is this, dear? This is Putts Bar and Grill. This is Putts Bar and Grill. So we had Putnam Bail Bonds. Now it's Putts Bar and Grill. What's your name? Kelly. Kelly. Have you been to the chili cook-off before? Yes, I have. More than once, right? Yes, I have. Yeah, I've seen you out here cooking some chili before, yes. right? What's special about uh, Putts Bar or Bar and Grill's chili this year? Monica. What's special, what's what's special, special about chili? chili? It's a secret. What's your name? Monica. Monica says it's a secret. A lot of people have secrets here today. I find that out about chili cook-offs. Monica, you having fun? Yes. Excellent. Who's over there? Ginger. Ginger. We got... A spy. Hey, who's the little guy? Hey, you want to talk? Uh -huh. yeah. Do you want to like you? You got to look that way, though. Come here. Hi. I don't know who you are, but I'm picking you up because you're so darn cute. We just got, we just got photo bombed here. <laughs> Say one tonight or something. One Say, night. I love chili. Say, this I love chili. one night and <laughs> nine. This is the best ever. This is why we do the chili cook-off. I got my new star of RTC TV. He literally will not give me the microphone back. And that's okay. Ask her how the chili is. Say, how's the chili? The chili's wonderful, isn't it? He's a natural. Look at it. It's awesome. You're a star, my friend. I'm going to take this. I'm going to take this. Can I have this? No, he will not give it back. Let him have it back. All right, give it back. You are so cool. Hey, can I get five back here? So, uh, Putts Bar and Grill, get out here to get their chili. They got Kelly Ike Eisenhower playing tonight up at Putts Bar and Grill. Yes, get out and yes. see that if you can. Great time at the Chili Cook-Off. Thank you, yes, ladies. Thank you. We're at the Chili Cook-Off, as you can tell, from this wonderful booth. Who am I with? The dugout this year, right? That's right. The Actually, dugout. Crystal. Here? Crystal with the dugout here. Now, the dugout is new management, a new look, totally reinvented. Yep. All renovated inside, inside and out. Right. Everything's redone. Everything's nice and clean and bright. And, yeah. Reinvesting yeah. in uh, a tradition here in Rochester, right. the dugout. So get out to the dugout anytime you can. Anything special about your chili? Yes, everything. Everything is special it's about the chili. From, uh, anybody else's, I can guarantee you. I love to hear that. <laughs> the smell is phenomenal, by the way. Yes. Hey, who do we have back here cutting? That's Nate. Nate? Yep. All right, Nate. Got any uh, secrets to your chili recipe you want to share? Oh, it's her recipe. Oh, it's her recipe. Yeah. He's just executing, he can't right? Share it. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, guys, thanks for being out. Thank a you. great job. We look forward to your chili here in a bit, okay? Right. Yep. Hey, Scott Sager here. We're at the uh, Rochester Martial Arts booth this year. They're busy working, so I, I'm not going into the kitchen because they'll put me to work. But we'll go through quickly here and say hello. Angela, correct? Yes. What's your name? Angela. Angela. Tracy. 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 Another Tracy. She's hiding behind me. Can't even see her. That's all right. She she did that on purpose. I'm guaranteeing you. So we've got the Rochester Martial Arts booth. We got little ninjas everywhere. We like the ninjas. First year for a booth for you ladies? Yes, it is. First year of some some new timers. Okay, and they've got some info right here. Look at this. Kickstart program, six weeks for sixty-nine bucks. Uniform and taekwondo class included. That's Rochester Martial Arts downtown Rochester so look them up give them a shout and uh, if you're out here today get some chili because it uh, it's you can also go to the school we're having demonstrations done at the school today excellent so today all day demonstrations down at the school well thank you very much for being a part of the chili cook-off
nope. the Farm Bureau not in charge of anything. insurance not in charge is of Carrie anything. Weaver. No, she's really not. But this is my sister Carrie. She doesn't like it when I interview her. I did. Uh, we did this when we were in school together. She didn't like it then. We were in school together. You're way older. That's than true. Me. I'm really old. We see Kevin Rainey back there is in charge of making sure the chili's warm enough. No, it's hot. It's hot. Interesting. No one here wants to be the authoritative figure. That's all right. Justin. Justin Brady. I, I had to go. I had to go to the uh, cooks meeting. Sorry. Yeah. The cooks meeting. So cooks meeting we're gonna get this out of our way while we talk to you, so we can see you. Sure. So we've got uh, Indiana Farm Bureau. You guys were out here last year too, right? Uh, we skipped last year. Okay. Year before then. Yep. We've okay. done it before. I've seen you and Kevin in some video at some point. Yeah. Making chili. We're really good at it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, we want to thank you guys for all the support you do for this community and uh, for being out here today for the Chili Cook-Off. Cool. Thanks. Scott Sager, we're still at this Chili Cook-Off, and I'm telling you what, we've got more booths this year than they know what to do with. That is so many varieties of chili. It is just incredible. I got this guy. He looked like he was in charge, so I grabbed him. <laughs> I love, what a look. What a look. <coughs> so what booth are we at this year? Whose booth is this? Woodlawn Hospital. Okay, he got that right. So we're, we're going to get a roll going here. Now, you got some spice going in that. I can smell it when I get back here. Is this going to be a spicy chili or a sweet chili? It starts out sweet and then it gets spicy. Oh, I like it. A little bit of both. You should be in marketing when you grow up. A little bit of sweet, a little bit of spicy. I like it. What's your name? Braden Kafka. Braden, future uh, videographer right here. A talent on NBC one of these days perhaps, right? You done the chili cook-off before? No? First time? Yeah. Yeah? Are you enjoying it so far? Mm -hmm. Did you have to get up at like 5 o'clock this morning and start making chili? 7.45. 7.45 on a Saturday. That's incredible. We got some others. Come on into the shot here so we can talk to some others. Right. Oh, I'll come to you if you don't come to me. That's the way it works for the chili cook-off. Get up back here. Right here. How you doing? <laughs> I'm good. What's your name? Matt. Matt. Kopka. Matt Kopka. Yeah. Woodlawn Hospital's booth, right? Yep. Excellent. Absolutely. Excellent. What do you do out there? Well, on, I do, my wife works there. She's director of surgery. Ah, wife is director of surgery. Yep. Becky, right? Yes, it is. Yeah, I met Becky. All right. We did a video out there a few years ago. So, your first time to do the chili here? It is. Excellent. Absolutely. You having fun? Oh, I'm loving it. Turn the side of the head so we can see the bam. Nice. <laughs> Thing I love the most is people come out and they get to have fun. They get to have fun all morning long. It's chili. It's food. It's cars. There was a 5K run earlier. It's just a great day out here, don't you think? Yeah, absolutely. Excellent. It is. Thank you for being out hey, here. We appreciate everything Woodlawn does for this community. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Hey, Scott Sager here. We got two guys chili. Now, I will tell you one thing. As I uh, make these videos, I do research beforehand. I start looking backwards at some of the old chili cook-offs, and I'm going to tell you, I see two guys, two guys, two guys, two guys, two guys. They've been here a long time. Have you been, been to everyone since the beginning? or Seven years. Seven years. So yeah. quite a few years these guys have been a part of this. You come over from Bruce Lake, right? right. Or Lake Bruce? Mm -hmm. yeah. Either way you want to say it. Either way you yeah. want to say it. What's your name again? John Waters. John? Paul Bradley. And Paul. Doing a great job here with the chili. Did you switch it up this year? Is it the same recipe? Same recipe. Yeah. yeah. Well, you guys have won before, have you not? Yeah, we won the last two years, People's Choice, and uh, was it 2012? We won the Judges Award. Yeah, we, we placed uh, six out of the well, seven six years. Six out of the seven years. Six out of the seven years they've placed. So you know it's some good chili eats. Hey, come on down. Get some chili here today at the Chili Cook Off here in Rochester. Guys, keep coming back. We enjoy what you do. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Yeah, they're back here. They were trying to hide, but they're back here. And I'm, I'm just going to say this. Texas people say that they got the best chili ever, and Texas is full of Republicans. So I'm at the Democratic, Fulton County Democrats booth for their chili, but I got to tell you, it smells pretty darn good. I think they might know what they're doing. Who we got back here? Shot of Mueller. Look at this. At your clerk right there for the city of Rochester. We got a young lady back here I recognize. Shelly Cole. Shelly Cole. She's on the ticket uh, this November, so uh, be thinking about voting for her. We got this guy. He's just the chili guru, and I'm not going to touch him because he's covered in chili. <laughs> David, come on over. You got to say hi. Hey. David Rowe, to those who know him, and this young lady everybody knows. Cheryl Downs. Cheryl Downs, educator. I don't say former educator because you never stop, right? Excellent. Well, forever learner. Forever learner. I love that. 
Well, you guys, as always, thanks for coming out uh, as a party and, and doing this and being a part of the Chili Cook-Off, okay? Thank you. Thanks for having me. Thanks, guys. Okay, Scott Sager here. We're at the first financial bank, right? Did I say it right? First is the big word. Put the emphasis on the first, right? Yes. See? I know. I know. First Chili Chicks. I like it. I may get in trouble for that, but I like it a lot. Who do I have here today? I'm Laura Hazlitt. Chris Riley. Kim Spore. Tina Egolf. Excellent. Well, ladies, uh, you done the chili before, or is this your first year? First year. First year. We got some newbies. I love it. Well, thanks for coming out. What's the, uh, what's the winning combination? What's going to do it for you this year? You got a secret spice you're not going to tell me about? Nope, it's all on the board right there. Oh, they put it all on the board. Look at this. That's right. I like that's the first time in all the years I've covered the chili cook-off that they said the best part of our chili is our personality. <laughs> that's right. But I, I would believe it. I really would. I want to thank you again for coming out. First Financial Bank supporting the community here with a great chili team. Good luck today. We look forward to trying your chili. Thank you. Thanks, ladies. Hey, Scott Sager here. Chili booth. Numero, I don't know. We've covered so many today. I have no idea how many I've covered. We've got some beautiful ladies here. Okay, a little hairy down there, but <laughs> what's your name, dear? Robin Overmeyer. Desiree Godsey. Crystal Raider Store. Excellent. And we are with? Life Care Center. Life Care Centers of Rochester. Excellent. Well, you guys do a lot of great things in the community. You're obviously a community-based uh, organization. First time for Chili? You done this before? No. We well, well, Life Care has, but yeah. we okay. have not. This is, so, this is our first. The company's done it before, but this is the first time for these three ladies. Off to a good start this morning? I think so. Yeah? yeah. It smells good. It yeah, it does <laughs> smell good. It does smell good. Well, uh, tell us about some of the things you guys do out there at Life Care. Uh, Life Care Center of Rochester has uh, skilled nursing care. Do you notice how she just jumped right into this spiel, by the way? It's interesting. I'm, yeah, yeah, exactly. Let me get back to her here. We have long-term care. We have a secure memory care unit uh, for Alzheimer's and dementia. And we do a little bit of everything. You break a, heat, a knee, hip, anything like that, we're, we're helping you fix it up. Short-term care, long-term care, they're there for you. It's Life Care Center of Rochester. These ladies out here, daycare if you need. Respite care. Respite care, they're all over. If you need any kind of care, I'd call them first. I mean, they'll help you out one way or another. Hey, see some friends over there. Thanks for coming out to the Chili Cook-Off. Well, ladies, thank you for coming out to the Chili Cook-Off. Thanks for doing this. And I'm going to let you back to your chili because they're going to start serving soon, okay? All right. Thank, thank you. you. Thanks, ladies. Thank you. How you doing? Too slow. Too slow. Oh, you got it on the third one. Too slow. All right. Good job, guys. You're so big. They're all right in the... We've had our first injury. Broke can't can't even see me. Making the chili. He broke his collarbone making the chili just yeah. because he was so just it had to be stirred and it had to be stirred a lot. Yeah, well, who so, am I talking to here? Uh, this is Tim Rowe with the Fulton County Public Library. Uh, so we got a good team back here. They all want to hide, but yeah, they're hiding. I'm going to get back here. You know how I do it. I have to sneak back here like a sniper. <laughs> What's your name? Um, Andrea Steinbach. Andrea, you can't see her, but that's her. Chris and Childers. Hey, I like the outfit too. Way to get behind it. I'm Brendan Grubbs. All right, Brendan. Tristan Grubbs. Excellent. Don Grubbs. Don Grubbs. Well, the Grubbs family helping out today. We appreciate that. Oh, we missed one. Who's this? Taylor Grubbs. All right. Well, the whole clan's out. Thank you very much for all that you guys do, not only here at the Chili Cook-Off, but for all the things you do for this community. We thank you guys. Thank Library you. literacy, very, very important components to a good culture, and you guys are a part of that, my friend. Perfect. Thank Thanks you. for being here. Thanks for all you do. Hey, Scott Sager, we are with the uh, Grace United Methodist Church booth, a winner many years for their uh, decorative, if not for their chili. And this year's theme looks a little uh, Captain America based, right? Right? We've got some people here. I'm going to step this way so that you can see these young ends. What's your name? Uh, Bill Griff and Gates Newton. Excellent. Well, thanks for being out here. You guys see this guy? He doesn't get out in public much. He works behind the scenes. Dan Funk, right? Yep. Dan Funk from Rochester High School. This young lady over here. Rachel Arndt. Rachel Arndt. Just don't make her mad. It's probably the best thing to say about Rachel. No, I'm kidding. Great lawyer with Peterson, Wagoner, and Perkins, LLP here in Rochester. Get you out of trouble, Scott. Yes, yes. Hopefully I don't have to call you for that reason, but we'll see what happens. We got a guy back here. 
Justin Miller. Justin Miller. I babysat this guy once or twice when he was about this tall, so I'm feeling a little old right now. Let's go to some youth. What's your name, dear? <laughs> Laura Roberts. <laughs> Laura Roberts. See, she's doing a wonderful job with her decorations here. You can't see her stockings, but they are in theme. I'm just going to say it. And Yes, get the stockings. She's going to get down there. Now, more of my way is the cowboy boots over there with uh, this young lady. Hi, Abby Reenie. Abby Reenie back there, keeping everything flowing smoothly. That's what we do here. Well, uh, whose idea was it for the booth? Laura's. Laura came up with the Captain America theme. Pretty good, but not Civil War, right? This no. is this is the cohesive it's, uh, Captain America. Well, it's, it's kind of a play on the Captain America, but it's also uh, Grace Church's 100-year uh, anniversary, so it's our Centennial Chili. Wow, did she just combine this and this and this, yeah. put it all together, kind of like you do with chili, right? That's right, yeah. The meat's been frozen 100 years, Scott. Yeah. <laughs> they, I'm, I'm not even going there. I, I, Dan, I've been doing this for five, six years. You're the first to ever stump me. Speechless. Hey, thank you guys in all sincerity for all that you do. I'd say it's great chili right up to the point where they've got a Purdue spatula. Yeah. I just don't know if I can handle that. But uh, hey, for all you IU fans, there's plenty for you to do as well. Come on out to the chili cook off right here today. Hey, Scott Sager. Hey, and Jim Howard. Jim Howard, you know Jim from last year. They have started the Church of the Heartland here in Rochester. And I'll tell you what, it's just doing great, isn't it? Oh, we're just uh, growing like weeds and uh, just just enjoying being part of this community. We've fallen in love with everyone here, and um, we're just having a great time together. Well, between you and QH, I'll tell you what, there's more love and, and just, uh, I don't know, Christian evidence. I don't know. Don't stop crying on me. No. I know, on, I know. You guys on, are just great back. people. Hold it I back, love you guys. Scott, hold it back. Hey, in all seriousness, you guys are out here. You're doing great things for the youth of this community, which is near and dear to my heart. Uh, tell me about your chili team today. Who you got over there? Oh, wow. We have, we have Serena. Wave. We have Greg, Eileen, and Brenda Gertie, and Jody Boldry. She's the one that keeps keeps the thing in line there. Well, everybody's doing a great job. Any secrets to your chili um, that you want to share? I'm telling you, you just have to ask that lady over there. She keeps adding, and I keep adding. She says, what do you think? I says, yeah, yeah. That's what makes a good chili. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Yeah, yeah. It's Everything good. good. It's good. It's well, a great, perfect day for this. It day. is gorgeous so, today. Nice anyway. and cool. Kept the bees away, which we were worried That's about. Right, We've had that right. in years past. You got a nice Conestoga wagon out here. You got your props flying away, so we'll let you get back to your chili, okay? Right, Thanks, care, Jim. Scott. Hey, we're here. We got another chili booth. I'll tell you what, it is just a sea of chili here today. Ladies, where are we? What booth? St. John's Lutheran Church. St. John's Lutheran Church. <laughs> Woohoo! You have to say it that way. St. John's Lutheran Church. Wahoo! Fiery furnace. Fiery furnace. I like it. Well, last year we had a lot of uh, stuffed animals puppets up here, right? Yeah. It was a great looking booth. Did you win awards last year at all? No. No. I think it was rigged. I'm just saying. It's just me. <laughs> no. Yeah. Good competition is really what that says. A lot of people with a lot of great ideas, and we love to see them all. Let's go around and introduce some folks. Who do we have here? Burgess Smith. Excellent. Stephanie Jones. Excellent. Eden Jones. I look that way and say it. Eden Jones. Excellent. Now you're a star. Jared Ginninger. David Smith. Gail Karras. Leslie Gressley. Jeanette Price. We got more up here. Back up the camera. Come on. Anita May. Who's this guy? Mike Holliger. Oh, Bernie Yangi. See, he didn't even know what he was doing. He just said his name. <laughs> well, your booth looks great. Nice little theme here this year. Spooky kind of Halloween-y a little bit on the shirts. I like it. Yeah. Although, it's you've the got the furnace. colors, but I get it. I yeah, get it. It's the fiery <laughs> furnace. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego that were in a pri the fiery prison, yes. and and God came and saved them. They didn't burn, did they? They didn't burn. No. So see, we're in the fiery prison. I like it. They're not going to burn today. I get it. I, it took me a minute. I'm a little slow. <laughs> but I got it now. The fiery furnace makes perfect sense. Spicy chili, sweet chili, a little bit of both. What do you got? A little bit of both. A little bit of both. Okay. Well, I'll be back and taste that. I want to thank you guys again for being a part of this. Thanks for all you do for this community. Thank you. 
Hey, we're here again, and uh, I, I almost couldn't recognize you today, Kenny. <laughs> Honestly, I couldn't. It, it just looked like a natural look for somebody no, I went to high school with. <laughs> <laughs> We've got the, the Kroger team here doing a great job, as always. Great competitors, great corporate citizen here in uh, Rochester, Fulton County. What's this young lady's name? I'm Carrie. Carrie? I'm Kenny. And Kenny, K and K. I like it. Actually, KC. Yes. Oh, she's a C. She's a C. All right, Casey, I like it better because KK, yeah, I didn't yeah, want to go there any further there. than I had to. Yeah. So uh, you've always got a unique blend of chili out here. In fact, last year you had a couple versions, right? Yep. Last year we had uh, vegetarian and this year and then the regular right. chili. This year, Carrie's idea to just, she, this is her, her famous chili at home. Excellent. So, yeah. Excellent. We're see what we can do with it. Well, very good. Well, all the ingredients bought at Kroger's, correct? They are bought at Kroger. You know that many of them, in fact, Kroger brand. They every Actually, everything that we are using today is Kroger That's, brand. That's, see? Ta-da, Vanna. Please bring out the product. Yes. Well, thank you, Carrie, Kenny. And, and, and please note that this 25th is the 25th anniversary, anniversary of it. It is. We have celebrated it right here. I like it. A couple of balloons. You're the first to do so. That and should get you some points. Tray with a silver bowl. And You're thinking about we, it. We Molly Smith. Everything. Molly Smith uh, was the originator of the chili cook-off, or one of the inspirations behind it. I actually had an opportunity to uh, reach out to Molly. She lives in Florida now and is on an evacuation, so she couldn't make it up <laughs> to the 25th year. But uh, she looks forward to coming back sometime. And uh, I appreciate the fact you brought that up because I had not yet today. 25th year for the Chili Cook-Off. Red Hot Car Show started a couple years afterwards, but a great combination. And boy, does it bring a lot of people to Fulton County. It so sure does. Thank you guys for all you do down there at Kroger's. Thank you. All right.